Good morning, my little coffee beans. So this morning, I thought I would talk to you guys about something that has really been weighing on my heart um, because I, it, it really took me a while to learn how to adjust from work to home. So I wanna talk about the transition from work to home and I guess vice versa. The number one thing that I can just tell y'all is have a routine, have a pattern um, that you go through to really bring your physical self and your mental self and to be present in, in your home life. When you're in college, you're constantly at work. You go to class, you come home, <clears throat> you study, and you take a few moments for yourself, but those are almost stressful because you should be studying. And so this freedom that I gained after graduating and getting a real job where after you know six o'clock, all of a sudden I have this chunk of time until I go to bed where I don't have things from work to do. I can be completely present and I can do anything I want and it's not something stressful. It's not something weighing on my heart. And that has been so freeing. So one thing I do when I get home from work, you know, I work with kids, so I just get disgusting throughout the day. First, I get home, I run up and I hug Blake if he's home and I tell him one fun story from my day. After that, I take a shower or a bath <laughs> and I get clean, um, and then I change into whatever I need. If we're going um, out or something, I'll change into cute clothes. Um, if I'm staying in, I'll change into like, you know, loungewear. Um, and so, or sometimes like if I know I have a completely free day, I'll change into pajamas and to, you know, cook and clean and um, listen to music and write and get things like that done and read a book. Y'all on a side note, this, my sweet, um, my sweet family-in-law got me for my birthday and I've been using this every single day of my life since they got it for me because I love reading so much and I read every single day. Um, but look how fun this is. You just like, you put it on your shoulders and you then like wrap it like this. Y'all, this is the coziest thing that has ever happened to me ever. It is so soft. Like I have been living in this. I almost took it to work by accident. I walk in hug Blake, tell him a fun story, get, take a bath, take a shower, um, get in new clothes, and then I revisit my home to-do list. So I have a to-do list at work that when I think of something at work, I write it down and I review that at the end of the day and the beginning of the day. And if there's something I need to do at home, like set up my direct deposit or something, I'll go ahead and move that to the at-home list under the work category and that takes precedent for me because um, I want to be a consistent worker. That's what my desire is. That's what I want my name to be in my mind. For my work, I want to show consistency in that. Um, and of course that means like if I have like a super high fever, I'm obviously not gonna go in. So I check my home to-do list, which has things that need to be done, things that need to be done in the next month, and then things that I can do for fun. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for taking the time and watching my video and I will see you in my next video.